These are a range of file tools that are used for waste removal. They can be used on plastics, woods and metals. This is a flat file. It's made up of a handle. This part of the handle is called a fur. This steel part uh, sticks into this handle here, and this part here that sticks in is called a tang, T-A-N-G. The furl protects the handle from splitting when you're applying the file into the handle. The file then is made up of a cutting surface and a cutting edge. On the other edge of this flat file is smooth, and this is known as a safe edge. Safe edge. How we identify a file is by the profile. This is a rectangular profile. This is known as a flat file. Other types of file then we have are, this would be a half round file. Flat on the bottom and a curved top. Again we have the handle, the tang, the furrow, cutting surfaces. The file's cutting surface come in smooth to rough and to very rough. This one will be known as a round file, because it's on the profile, it's rounded. And this is a quite rough file, cutting surface all the way around it. Here we have a square file, we look at the profile, the profile is square. This one here is known as a triangular file, as you can see, the profile is a triangle. The last one here, a little bit different, the shape of it here tapers out. This is known as a warding file. The surface of this is quite smooth. So this is a warding file. Again, a couple of different files here. Very small files. These are known as needle files. Needle files. Used for quite accurate work. Try to get into smaller places. Again, the profiles are quite similar to the large ones. So that's how you can identify flat one and try a square file. On, sometimes on drawings we'll notice um, files are indicated by icons. So we have five icons here so we'll, we'll match the files with these five icons. So our first one is a flat file. If we look at the profile here it's shown as a rectangle. You'll also notice these little lines that are coming along on the surfaces. Or the, and these indicate the cutting surface and you'll notice this one has no lines indicating that there's no cutting surface like our flat file here we have a smooth surface on one of the edges which is known as the safe edge so that's our flat file our next file then is flat on the bottom and round on the top that is known as the half round file Similar to this one, flat on the bottom and rounded on the edge, the top edge. That's our flat, half round file. Our next one is a completely circular, so it's our round file. That's our round file there. And we have next one is our profile is square. You'll notice again the lines sticking out represent the cutting surface all the way around on this file here, which is the square file. And our last one is a triangular icon with cutting surface all the way around, similar to this one here, and that's our triangular file. 